Okay. Back to our freaking usual round of exploration. We gotta find that final freaking stamp. And he said the stamps are always outdoors. No caves or buildings or whatnots. No, 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 no. I'm not leaving. Good. Don't. Not yet. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> okay. If I was hugging stuff and things, where would I be hiding? Like right there. Like right there. 23 more to go. Walk right into that. <laughs> yes, he did. Okay, nothing here. There's a bunch of friggin' armadillo lowers. So I'm sure there's got to be freaking something else I can do in one of the freaking towns for quests and whatnot. Okay. I wonder what that stupid quest to find the Zol nobody's ever seen before would give me. Freaking... Already up here, right? Yes. Yep. Okay, let's go down here where the freaking trees are. See if there's anything good down here. Pointless chest. Not worth freaking grabbing. That's the sleeping child. Nothing here. Okay. Alright, uh, let's go see if there's a side quest somewhere in Zora Village. Man, I wish there were freaking trophies in this game to let me know. Oh, hey, yep, you did all the side quests. There's not. There is not. Item shop. Nope. Worthless. That bitch who wanted to learn how to swim to go see the great fairy. Hmm. Has to freaking be important in some capacity. Right? Wouldn't just freaking put her there for nothing. Hmm. <laughs> I wish a side quest appeared on the map. That'd be nice. No, Chief, you still doing? Still doing. Okay. Good for you. Hmm. 
There's seriously nothing else up there? I find that fucking hard to believe. But that may be, that may just be true. There's just the heart piece up there. Crab's here. Super odd, there's nothing here. Aww. For a cave entrance of some sort or just anything. Nothing. Yeah, seriously, nothing. Hmm. Just a vast emptiness. Yep, that's useless. Like, freaking, there's like a whole lot of nothing in the ocean, too. Ah, I have to think there's a stamp here somewhere in Southern Forest. Because I never got any. Uh, there's no stamps obtained there. Is there any stamps around here? Nobody I got that stamp this. down oh, there, yeah, and I got yeah, that okay, stamp okay. up there. Okay, okay, then yeah, I don't think there would be one there. Okay. There might be. In like the pocket corner. Possibly. You want to go up? I can't go any further to the right. Oh, okay. Okay, so that was the freaking cove I had to freaking go save some people in. Here's the stamp. You weren't missing that, are you? Nope. If it's if it's iconed on the map, it's Oh, obtained. it's there. Okay, okay. Also, if there's no actual freaking stamp on the stand, it's also obtained. Hmm. Aha! Side quest. Has Sheep Kushar been avoiding me? What else could it be so suddenly? I must have done something wrong. She must think me an unreliable assistant. Oh, Lady Zelda. I fear you heard me going on about my predicament. You see, Chief Kushar has been acting a little peculiar lately. She's been leaving our village often ever since our troubles with the rift stopped. Yet when I ask what's taking her away from us so frequently, she says it's nothing at all. I did find out, however, that Chief Kushar has been consulting Chief Dread on some matter. This isn't unusual, given that they were friends long before they were our chiefs. But we're so used to her relying on all of us Caesar too. This makes me feel quite uneasy. Lady Zelda, can I tell you to ask Chief Dread about this mysterious matter? Perhaps you can get an answer. I suspect that Chief Kushara told him to keep, told her to keep it from me, or told him to keep it from me. I will give you anything you ask in return. Just please help me with this terrible situation. All right, give me twenty-two mic crystals and eight heart pieces. <laughs> It's a very peculiar shape. And it meant nothing. I don't need no damn bubble kelp. In case you do, it's like... But I don't. But you do it there. Maybe the girl needs bubble kelp. Well, it didn't allow... Uh, it didn't begin... Yep. Give me the ability to offer it to her. Oh, book help. Uh, 
I don't see the purpose of that. Go in every freaking house. See if there's some loose at the side quest. Okay. Thought for you for a second, maybe I could open up the hatch. Nope. Bah! Shut up. You're a dumb child. Can't handle this. Okay. Well. Yes. We'll do the one thing we know we can do. Go consult the chief. The double chief. I bet she was consulting him on love. I bet she loves him. You bet she loves him. A kissy face. Hey, <laughs> kissy face. <laughs> Yo, chief. You son of a bitch. <clears throat> I've been the boss of new assistant for a few weeks. We were together all the time. But now this, I can't take it. Avoiding me, whispering with Kushara. Seriously, what's this about? I'm new. I'm learning, so I get that he can't tell me everything. Still, it's going on all the time now. I'm way past sad. I'm boiling over. Hey, guess what? Shut up. It's none of your business. Huh? You want to know where the boss is? Hm, don't know. Ask the other Rivazora in the village. He's been talking to some of them. Maybe they know something. <laughs> You're a bitch. Well, thanks for help with that whole thing. You know, when I was shining at the big shot, I got myself shined by monsters. When I got back, Boss Rad scolded me for that mess. Guess he was worried. He watches out for me more than I really knew. So I still want to be a big shot. But I'm going to get there in a better big shot way next time. Man, everybody's just a freaking bunch of whiners. Fancy paper? Isn't that what Caesar will write letters on? Pretty sure, anyway. Oh, hi there, Zelda. Oh, you want to know where the boss Drad's gone to? One thing I know is he got a letter and then ran off in a hurry. Where? That I don't know, but I saw him talking to tell him. He might know. I'd say talk to the other Zora here. You might find out something more. But where Tellum's going off to, that I don't know either. Why don't you ask around? Fuck. We've got to fix up anything that's broken, like houses and bridges, and made friends with one C Zora who came here to help. <laughs> Looking for Boss Dread, he walked off all of a sudden, right in the middle of our talk. Tell him I know where, about where the boss was headed. Tell him went fishing east of the village, but I bet he's slacking somewhere in a corner. Yes, dear? Yes. Slacking in the corner? No. You know about the corner slacking. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Oh, yeah, you do. I'm not slacking. Corner slacking. Fine. I will go corner slack. Look at the sky. All my cares just drift away. You should try sometime. Hey, you should shut up. You slacking? <laughs> Gah! Found me. Slacking. I'm not slacking, I swear. I was about to start fishing. Huh? It's just you, Zelda. What are you doing here? What? You want to know where the boss has gone off to? I don't know for sure. He mentioned Chief Kushar. It's a wild guess, but maybe he's gone to the cave in Zora Cove? The boss of Kushar used to play there since they were old enough to swim. It used to be great for swimming races, but lots of monsters live in that cave now. Okay. Somewhere around there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll come back here for that side quest later. Bah, shut up. So, 
Clearly not this cave. Probably the other cave. Dark Rain Flooded Cave. Save their waters. Chief Cross for Kylie Beam. Sure she'd be delighted if you visited her. Well, you know, trying to. Uh. What the? Those caves. Uh. Where's the freaking mosey in? I'm literally sitting right next to the fucking chest. Why can't I lock onto it? Because of the crabs. Yeah. 50 rupees is decent, but it's also fucking pointless because I'm rich as hell already. Remember when I needed money? I don't know. Yep. Mm, that's deep sea kelp. Aha! Deep <laughs> sea kelp. It was too obvious to contain the loot. You all fuckers here? Oh, you fucking spying? Ah, Miss Zelda, I'm sorry that I left my post. I saw Chief Bashar, you see, and then I followed her here. Then Inawa found me. Chief Dry has been avoiding Inawa. We're in the same boat, it seems. She and I are going to ask the Chief what's been going on, but our timing is off. I'm gonna do it, I ain't a bitch. <laughs> huh? Yeah. Ah. Zelda, what brings you here? What? Ina and Ragma said we've been acting different? No, we aren't. Not at all. You're being weird. Shut up. It's none of your business what he does. Inawa, please, we shouldn't. I want answers. Now. You don't deserve answers. Boss, what's the big idea? Avoiding me. Having secret meetings with Kushara. Sure, I'm new to the job, but it's my job, and I want to do it right or not at all. Okay, you're fired. Yes, I feel just the same. Perhaps some matters are for chiefs only, but we are here to be of assistance. I'm sorry. So here's the truth. The two of us want to thank the two of you. Not sure how yet, but it was our fault you two were put in harm's way during the crisis. We thought it best to put our heads together, just Kushara and Drad. No formalities. We want our thanks to be personal, though we're still trying to figure out what's best. Looks like we've bungled it, though. Didn't mean to make you too worry. It's hard to just be ourselves in matters where we should speak from the heart. So, Ragma. Yes? Thank you for saving me. I'm not perfect, but I hope I can keep asking for your support. Chief Kushara. Of course. Nothing in the world would make me happier. Hey, thanks to you too, Inawa. Even though, you know, I freaking, if they freaking followed me... And got in the way of me trying to find a good way to thank them and give them platitudes and gifts and shit. And they stumbled on and then started fucking yelling at me, demanding answers for what I'm doing. I would just be like, none of your business. I was going to give you a thank you gift, but now fuck you. You you know me, I charge right in and I don't even see the small stuff. So yeah, thanks for keeping me out of messes before I make it me now. Boss, I never knew you felt that way. Also, you're fired. But maybe you should charge in a little less and look around a little more. Maybe you should shut the fuck up. He's the chief. He does what he wants. <laughs> Still, I'm a happy Zora. I'll work twice as hard to keep things on an even keel. <clears throat> Seems that everyone's getting along fine now. You focus yet again, Zelda. You and that round thing you keep with you. I'm not a round thing. I'm try. Sure, sure. You got it, round thing. <laughs> At some point, I'd like to make this round thing you... I'd like to meet this round thing you keep talking about. Oh, you can. I cleared out all the rifts. <laughs> Thank you, Lady Zelda. You helped us clear up this difficult misunderstanding. It wasn't a difficult misunderstanding. You're just an idiot. You deserve something really special for all this. Please, accept this brooch. Gold brooch. You receive even more often when you break objects in a few monsters. Woo, more money. Even though I don't fucking need it. <laughs> 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 
cries about the rupees, but wants more rupees. <laughs> Let's see what I hear out of you sometimes. Just flapping gums. Just flapping gums and creaking bones. I'm holding really down. I'm holding down really hard so you can't fucking get out of here. <laughs> I, just, I had to make sure I had you unlocked before I said something else stupid. <laughs> I'm gonna drown. But I did. Oh, I Found thought you was gonna die. Yeah, well, I didn't because you love me. I, I live on your love. <laughs> Monsters around the sea, the people of Seaside Village. Mm -hmm. But the real difficulty is finding just the right thing to put my treasure in. Ah, you heard all that, did you? I'm trying to work out a solution for something. I may as well fill you in. I want to store my treasure safely and secure. <laughs> it's just a collection of shells and rocks I found while swimming, but it's treasure to me. Yeah, well, you know what they say. One person's trash is everybody's trash, because trash will always be trash. If you polish a turd, it's still a turd. Just like me. I got clean hair, but I'm still ugly. I'm quite proud of my collection. <laughs> but I don't have room for it all. I need to find something I can store it in. That said, I've had no luck so far. It has to be just right for my storing needs. I'll find something. Really? Fantastic. Here's what I need. It's not much, but it's specific. I have to be able to store my collection securely inside of it. That means, even underwater, I don't want the contents to just spill out. I don't want the others order to go about my treasure, so I'll wait outside for you. Hmm. What would I fucking have? Like, a pot? You brought me something. This is a bad option. I fear that without a lid, it would not be useful underwater. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. Dude, that's all I got. <laughs> Dude, that's all I got. What? Yeah, that's all. What? You're telling me I, I'm supposed to have fucking way more furnishings than this? Probably. What the fuck? Nah, dude. Yeah, No dude. fucking shot. <sighs> yeah. Yes, Growly. Oh. Mm -hmm. You're fine. You're fine. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm angry. You'll be fine. No, I'm missing. <laughs> I'm missing shit. Yeah, well, good thing we're doing the cleanup stuff. I have the cleanup stuff only pertains to <laughs> heart crystals, heart pieces, mite crystals, and stamps. Yeah. It does not tell me where the missing fucking echoes are. Yeah. I have to beat the game for that. And in order to beat the game for that. I have to forego everything I'm doing now. So yes, I am angry. As you always say, let me feel my feelings. Okay, he can feel your feelings. I am angry. I feel angry. Okay, he can feel that feeling. That makes me feel angry. Okay. You can't just announce how your characters feel. That makes me feel angry. That'd be a perfect place for a fucking stamp.
There's freaking ser there's freaking there's probably not a goddamn thing up here, is there? Which is then now gonna freaking make me feel angry. Look at all those rupees. It was the chest that you got. Yep, not a single goddamn thing of note up here. That's a mic crystal, I haven't seen one. Okay, again. Interesting. <sighs> I'm still so many short 20. I'm still fucking missing 20 of them. The fuck are you? Oh, you're Lizalfos. Look at all this money that's fucking popping out that I don't freaking need. Wait. Oh, I don't think you have them. I don't think I have this one either. Oh, no. it's turning into money because you have the monies. No, no, no. I do have him. That, uh, okay. that is the that is the can't that is the fire one, but uh, since the stupid frog okay. was here it was making it rain, so he it turned it fucking blew out his candle. Ah, uh, okay, okay. So no, I have that. That's the Ignazol. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hello. Did you see it? Do you see it? Oh yeah, the the thing, the light thing. Do -do 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 -do. Okay now. Adventure. I'm an all star. I got my game on. Going to play. What the fuck? Lazolfo's level three. Can the ice rock get him? My phone died. It died. I believe so, yes. <laughs> you are a... Holy shit! He jumped up and did fucking blasted me. <laughs> what? It is Mega Dead. That is why I said that. <laughs> wow, it's freaking wrecked. Oh, come on. This better not only be for 50 rupees and Lizalfos level 3. Or y'all be freaking a little pissed. You know, Lizalfos level 3 is fucking crazy. This fire is also at home underwater. 
I'm gonna fucking just jump. Okay then. Wait for it, wait for it. <laughs> drown, bitch, mm. drown. Sorry, Lizard King. Wait, is he down here? Check the bottom. Definitely not the intended, but... Where's my Lionel? That is beyond rude. Like, I know killing him is pointless, but... I guess on the off chance I get something for killing all the enemies in this little mini dungeon. Freaking swing and a batter batter up. Man, for something so freaking small, this is actually quite big. So violently, you just rip its fucking head off at the stamen. Crazy. Where's this gonna fucking take me? This is not where I came in from. I don't believe, anyway. Damn. Okay. Okay. 
I can believe there's nothing this is in the like ring of that's an enemy encampment. Okay. This is the fucking Deku Village down. Oh there should be something here. At least something maybe here. Yeah. I'm about ready to have you freaking look up those two echoes I might need. Want me to do that now? I don't know. Okay. It's like, we're trying to think of where I fucking saw a jar with a lid to begin with. I honestly don't know if there's really been one, then, but I don't remember the shops, because maybe there might be something in the shops. Stuff! Useless. Yep. Shocker. I get more than that, just fucking mowing lawns. Yeah, okay. <laughs> a lot of money. Mm -hmm. Say more on that, just fucking landscaping. Zol that nobody has seen before. Let's see if there's anything left in here. The world may never know because the freaking the inner map is so useless. Anything in here? Oh, stampy, 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 stamp. Hmm. Two stamps there, one stamps there. Don't know. I'm running out of freaking places to look. Let's see if there's any fucking new side quests in Goron City, I guess. Doubting it, but can't hurt to double check. Oh, hey, there you go. Have you seen Darston? Nope. Your chief's an idiot. Let him go. Sorry, didn't mean to bother you, but Darston hasn't come back yet. A little while ago, we started hearing strange sounds coming from inside the volcano. Darston went to investigate, but I'm getting real worried since no one's seen him since. Last I saw him, the chief was headed for the summit. If you fly ahead in that way too, would you keep an eye out for him just in case? Okay. You betcha. Mysteries, mysteries. Oh, hi there, Zelda. Thanks again for saving me. I'm kind of a miser missable for a Goron. A lot of times people don't notice me at all. If you hadn't shown up, I might have been stuck in that rift forever. Just thinking about it gives me the shivers. Maybe I should go on a nice long run to warm him back up, you know? You should try a Goron race while you're here. They're the, our traditional sport. Okay, I'll try it. Ready, set, go, Ron. Okay. Okay.
Which one? Let's get to the flag first. Me. <laughs> you cheated. Oh, I lost. Racing was my one way to stand out in the crowd. And this track is where I've practiced the most. Dang it. The world's so big, I guess there's always going to be someone better out there. But I lost Rain Square. I want you to have this, Zelda. <clears throat> I'm going to practice running some more before I race again. I'll prove I can win. Want to go for a grand race? I do. Let's go. Hmm. Again, yeah, that was freaking just super easy. Freaking. I wonder if I can freaking beat him legit. Oh, you're cheating on me, huh? Okay. 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 Sort of legit. <laughs> What a bitch. Okay. Cheating is the way to do it. <laughs> you did it. You beat me. He did it. He beat me. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, okay. He got me again. Uh, I lose anyway. You gonna finish the race, guy? There you go. Okay, anyway. You gotta freaking let him have some of his fucking confidence. More fun to crush somebody's confidence. Perfect, but he promised. No, he didn't. Perfect. My brother said he'd go do the glider ride with me, but now he won't play at all. So I'm going to match the glider ride on my own. That'll show him. But it's hard. I want to find somebody to show me how. I'll show you how. Yay, thank you, miss. Let's go. Come on. Perfect. Glide pad. Huh? These side quests need to freaking be a little more rewarding. Freaking like 50 rubies here, some freaking garbage crap there. Mm. All right, freaking easy peasy. Freaking, you gotta glide without touching the ground at all from here to the flag. If you touch the ground, you gotta start over. Ready? Go. Oh my God, Zelda, will you fucking turn left for once in your miserable life? Easy. This one's easy enough to freaking. This one's easy enough to do on its own anyway. Just use my little fucking mushroom blower. You had coffee. What's the matter with you? I don't know. Just always eepy. That's all I'll tell you. Voila. Wow, you were great. You guys, smooth and strong, just like my brother does. Let me give you my snack. Ah, I hate you. God, I fucking hate you. Watch you was giving me lots of pointers. Thanks a bunch. Now I just gotta match the moves before the next time my big bro wants to play. 
Like, I hate the rewards for these fucking side quests. Hey, miss. Hey, miss. I told my brother Dissian about you, and he wants to meet you. Wait right here. Let me go get him. I'm going to beat his ass, too. Can't handle it when I have my fucking cheaty jets. Oh, so you're the one Seko told me about. I'm his older brother, Dissian. Thanks for demonstrating for him earlier. He was telling me how he met a Hylian gal who was practically a pro at gliding. I've been a gliding rider. I've been glider riding about three years myself. Think you can glide better than me? Yep. Spend a whole year making my own course. Think you can glide the Elden Death Road of Pain? Yes. All right, a new contestant on the Elden Death Road of Pain. You gotta stay focused so you don't wipe out. Don't get hurt. It'll be super freaking easy. Okay. Oh. Easy. Ta. Ta -da. You, you glided the entire Elden Death Road of Pain. <laughs> Asterisk. But I spent a whole year making it. Well, you should have made it better, but... Alas, I understand you can't. You're just a dumb rock idiot. You're incredible. Out of this world. No, you just suck. I mean, I never expected such a chance to just show up on the scene. The world moves fast. Always gotta move a little faster. But I'll give you this for conquering the Elden Death Road of Pain. That's what we're talking about. Three, two, two? God, I found more of that in a fucking bush. Now, as a veteran of the sport, I gotta warn you. Glider rides can be real dangerous. But if you're a thrill seeker like me, you're welcome to use the course anytime. Why would I fucking want to? That seems so pointless. You know? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's go find this stupid fucking chief. So this dumbass went up to the Elven Volcano. I fucking knew it. <laughs> Bitch, you don't see me no more. Oh, goodbye. This is just the part of the fireworks rope, huh? Yeah, I think so. Strange noise has been coming from Elden Volcano. Darson headed toward the summit to investigate, but hasn't been back yet. Probably here that I want to go, then. You can't get into the still world, so freaking. You gotta be pretty close by around here. No, I wanna go. Rock Roast Quarry. Yeah, no, because this, this leads me back to Goron Village, correct? Because I go through the back. Yeah, this is the fucking Goron Village. Want to race again? No? Yeah, loser. 
Can't handle my speed. He's just a loser, dear. Can't handle my speed. Look for freaking Darston, huh? Would he be in or outside? I wonder. And I'm assuming I can't get in the fucking volcano from the top, correct? Probably. Okay. Bring it home. You headed for the freaking summit. Did he ever make it? Huh. Okay. Strange always has been coming from Elden Volcano. Darston headed toward the summit to investigate, but hasn't been back yet. Right, there's no way he could have gotten in the still world. Like, that's just done and over with. Right? I just don't think he could have. Don't you do it? No, it didn't do it, but I did it. That's, this is getting really... Oh my god, of course. This is getting really obnoxious. Like, she's not moving forward when I'm trying to fucking move forward. And I can only stand on the clouds for about three seconds. I guess I'll just try and freaking go up the summit the normal way, and we're gonna see if I see him there. Because going up the super freaking fast way doesn't really seem to do me any good. You know? Yeah. There's a decent chance I miss doing that. <laughs> I disagree wholeheartedly. He wouldn't be in the Resolve Post for a way. No, he'd have no reason. He went to the Elden Volcano, no doubt about it. Danger, lava lake ahead. Um, actually, I'm gonna make my way up the volcano the way we had to do it initially through the back of the Chief's room. Probably what I'm thinking. Yeah, freaking like that. That's the only thing I can freaking think of that has a lid. Oh, I see. Hmm. But I can't learn it.
Oh my god. Let's try this again. Ceiling. How is the fucking ceiling? Darston, where the fuck are you, dude? Yeah, okay, no. Oh my god, Zelda, for the love of god. Move forward, please. Burn left, you fucking... Either way, okay, friggin'. So, this just takes me in there. So, friggin'. Mm. Like, this takes me into the Elven Volcano, but the, in the still world, I don't get it. What am I missing? Like, he can't get in here, right? Like, he shouldn't be able to get in here anyway. Still the Elven Volcano. Yeah. So he shouldn't be able to get in here. Because mm. as far as the story is concerned, that doesn't even exist anymore. Okay, this is Crater Shortcut. Like, what is the damn summit of this fucking place? This is the crater, but is this the summit? I just don't get it. I just don't know. If he's in here, I'm going to be actually really, really annoyed. I just don't freaking see how he could be. It doesn't look like it. Hmm. Oh, but there's, oh, there's a lot to check. Yes. Ooh. I'm going to figure out what a freaking Zol that nobody's ever seen before. Like, freaking really out there, Zol. Okay, this is Elden Temple, not Elden Volcano. Okay? This is so annoying. I don't like this quest at all. Not ready to look it up. I do. Okay. Like I'm freaking just giving up. Freaking. Like he's freaking clearly got to be freaking out here, but freaking where?
Maybe in the rock roast quarry, maybe? Copy. There's a fucking chest in here that I never got. Contains some useless ass potatoes. I didn't think he'd be in the fucking Lazalpo's burrow, but evidently he fucking is. Okay. Right? That one or is. Below. Summit Cave. Son of a bitch. Like, they did make it seem like he was at the top. Like, that freaking. That is such a useless hint. I passed by the super cave like 10 times, too. Oh, there his dumb ass is. Zelda, what are you doing up here? The elders asked you to check on me. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to go worrying you all. After the rift was mended, we started hearing these odd noises from inside Elden Volcano. I came to see if it has anything dangerous, and I found this cave. That ain't great. I'm afraid this can mean only one thing. There's an old folk tale about a flame giant who lives in Elden Volcano. Gorons don't mind fire, but this giant's supposed to be so hot it burns even us. The story goes that someone once put out its flames and trapped it inside the volcano. So maybe it sounds we've been hearing or the flame giant all lit up again? I hope it isn't, but if it is, we need to come up with a way to put out its flames again and fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cloud stairs. Thought I already freaking did everything in this cave, but freaking doesn't look familiar. But I was I was clearly already in here, or else it wouldn't have been marked on the map. Stuff. Uh, the bills. Your phone bill? I paid that. I know. What? Did it go through yet? Uh, yeah, I can see it in the thing. And then what? Were you waiting to go through my card? Card and. Well, well that's not going to go through until tomorrow, I'm sure. Because yeah, the bank was super. The bank was super closed when we did it. Yeah, true. So that's not going through until tomorrow. Yeah, true. Well, probably not even then. Oh, no, Monday. 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 Oh, no, no. Banks are open. Oh, no, yeah, Banks yeah, are open Saturday. on Saturday. Yeah, yeah no, that should be going through tomorrow. Okay. And even if we do have to wait a little longer, would that really be? Oh. That wouldn't be a big deal. Yeah. Where's my stupid lava rock? The lava rock is a rock. But the lava. <laughs> Why it costs four men, I don't know. I 
interesting. There, I know what I'm going to do. Yes. Good. This isn't going to work, is it? Uh, the, lava, the, the lava's going to keep rising. Yep. Can you put water on the lava rock? Probably, but since the rock costs four, I can only put oh. two, two waters. Where's my damn spider at? There he is. Oh my gosh. It doesn't it doesn't let me throw him while I'm in the fucking air, which is really obnoxious. Mm-hmm. Alright. Like what else floats on the fucking lava? Boulder? Sort of. Nope. Okay. It sort of floats. So that's how I guess I'm gonna have to do it. This should be relatively safe. Ish. Oh. Nice. Oh, it's the... It's a fire variant of the guy. The first boss. Interesting. Oh, it's super hot. Okay, fuck trying to pull it out of him. That's pointless. Yes, dear. Yes. Alright, where's my freaking ice to rock? Three. One of the ones I learned last. They should have to learn to cream his crop and take his fire away. Wow! Ten hearts? Dead. Wow! Game over. Ten fucking hearts worth of damage, huh? Okay.
Okay. We're gonna play by your rules, now you're gonna freaking play by mine. Now you're gonna play by mine. Okay. I'll get beam off time again. Come on, dude. God damn, oh my God, that's right. I can't fucking spin while I'm latched on. Like, I wish it was the spin button that detached and not the fucking R2, which literally got used for fucking virtually nothing. Now I'm going to use fucking all reliable. He should insta blow up when he throws his hands down. Oh, dang. Can't yep. spin, so I couldn't get out of there, and jumping is fucking... Uh... Okay. <clears throat> I'm done fucking around. I 
I'm done fucking her. Good. All right. Maybe. Where's my red with all posts? Resistance pipe. Okay, yeah, he, since he fucking leaped into the air. Perfect. Hey, you missed it. I didn't. I lost everything. Oh, it's on his back now. Ah, uh, that would be why it wasn't working before. No, uh, before it was on his head. Ah, uh, I see. Oh no, I meant like when you were... Because I was wondering why sometimes the bombs weren't hitting him. That would be why. No, it, it just became on his back. Last time it was on his head. There we go. Got him. Mm. Friggin'. Mm -hmm. Freaking crazy, like freaking. That was all false. Just jumps up and stabs, so it's easy to hit his head with that one. All right. So that was totally worth it. Hot to peace. I killed him. Zelda, there you are. You explored the whole cave already. And you defeated the flame giant? It was real? Wow, I'm at a loss for words here. First the rift, and now a giant straight out of legend. You really are something else, Zelda. Yeah, it's like I'm legendary. So like the legend of Zelda. <laughs> at least everyone in Goron City can rest a little easier now. Thank you so, so much, Zelda. Here's a little something to show our appreciation. Very strange. By wearing it, you can carry things. I don't give a fuck about that. Daryl and Brayson has been passed down through generations before. I talked to everybody about it, and we all agreed you used to have it, Zelda. Thank you for all your help. I'm gonna head back and tell everyone what happened. You take care of yourself, Zelda. Hmm. Oh, I have to equip it first. That actually might freaking be super helpful. In terms of mobility. Uh oh. Okay, well that's that. Yo, what's up, Brooklyn? How hey, you doing? Brooklyn. And nothing there. You know what I was just thinking? What were you just thinking? I was just thinking. What if... Can you show him a fairy bottle? No. Okay. Yeah, no. That'd be... That'd be decent, but no. I couldn't give it to him because those are freaking um, key items. Oh, okay. <sighs> Good thought, though. like that you're on the right track, but no. It's got to be something stupid. We are missing five. Counting five heart pieces. 